Once upon a time, a master called his student and told him to come along to watch him during his bow shooting practice. The student had already seen his master shooting his bow at least a hundred times, but nonetheless, he followed him obediently. They walked through the forest for some time until they reached the usual spot. A huge lightning with a big oak tree right in the middle of it. There the master proceeded to unpack the items he had brought with him. As usual, he took out his longbow and the arrows. And as usual, he took out a small flower from under his belt and fixed it to one of the oak's branches. Only this time, he also had a silken scarf with him, which he asked the student to blindfold him with and then to accompany him to the usual spot, more than 900 feet away from the tree. Then he took his shot, as usual. Now go and see if I hit the flower, then come back and tell me, he instructed the student. As he came near the tree, the student noticed that not only the flower was intact, but that the arrow hadn't even hit the massive oak and was nowhere to be seen. Confused, he went back to his master, uncertain how to tell him what he had seen. So tell me, my student, did I hit the center of the flower as I always do? The master asked him with a smile on his face. The student was feeling truly uncomfortable at this point. Master, you didn't hit the flower, not even the tree. I couldn't find the arrow. You must have missed by a great length, he answered, since he wouldn't ever lie to his master, who, strangely enough, didn't change expression by a bit and was still smiling serenely. But master, I don't understand, said the student. I thought you wanted to teach me that concentration and the power of thought would make the arrow find its target. Just so, my dear student, the master replied, seemingly pleased by his words. But you won't ever hit a target that you cannot see. You see in life, in your life, to get to your goal, to get to where you want to be in life, you first have to see it. You have to see your target. You have to see your goal. Otherwise, all the concentration and power of thought in the world will make you miss your target because you cannot see it. So open your eyes and see where you want to go in life. This is Dare to Do Motivation Stories. Thank you so much for watching and stay blessed.